Your girl is a Taurus sun. Focus on your peace, moving forward. If it shows up half-baked, half-cooked, half-made, half-ready, release it. Period. Stop forcing shit that's no one. Ain't gonna hold nobody. Ain't gonna fake shit, ain't gonna hold shit, ain't gonna make shit up. I love what I do. Cause I'm tap the fuck in. I'ma read this motherfucking course left, right, up, down, sideways, sideways. Fuck in. You hear me? Yeah, I read Mirror two. Tap the fuck in. In reverse. I'ma read these bitches. Hello, Libra. Welcome. Let's get into your messages. This will be for Libra. Any placements. Put the special energy take what resonates only from the multiple scenarios that will come out in this collective Libra reading. Anything you need to know about me will be down below. I am grateful for your support. For those that are new, welcome. Let's see what the spirit wants you to know. For Libra, what's the T? I ain't your spirit, guys, and that's just this, please. For Libra, any placement. Knight of Wands, the force of nature. Some of y'all could be impulsive. The moon in a tower. Okay, what's done in the dark will be brought out into the light. Straight like that. Justice. Spirit say, stop right there. I see why. Justice. Y'all energy. At the bottom of the deck. Okay, that says integrity. And the scales are not balanced right here. That is slanted. The star right behind that, y'all got major arcana and the high priestess, which means y'all are going through a lot. All of these major arcana bumping up against each other. So think about healing, humanitarianism, following your intuition, things that are done in the dark. High priestess, hidden, repressed, suppressed, deep within. Oh Lord, subconsciously, the moon and the high priestess showing up too close to each other. Okay, impulsive traits here, but let's clarify. Let's see. Some of you are getting brave here, needing to be brave. Mm, the unconscious mind some kind of plans thoughts ideas you may feel like you're not, are not ready you're not good enough this could be a relationship that's not really showing the best of you here not a wise to the moon some things that needs to be worked on and land that landed you in some kind of shocking revelation drastic change here with the tower it's giving cosmic energy though all of those comments coming towards that tower will which will be an awakening release Something you have to release or all of a sudden you did. Let's clarify. For Libra, embrace craving your favorite, uh, I can say your favorite touch. Oh my God. So they can definitely favor you in the bedroom or on top of whatever this is they on top of. But anyways, for some of y'all, they look like they outside. Yeah, they is in the, uh, one of them New York looking alleyways. But uh, for some of you, someone's craving your physical touch. Now, you could be in a connection that needs more affection. Or this is with this Knight of Wands energy. It's a friends with benefits dynamic. Let's see. Or oh, Libra. Someone wants more from you. I want you to spice it up. I got goals flipped over. Focus on something. That's what y'all should be tripping off of. Let's see. Knight of Wands for Libra. Or focus on Damn, that was like a bullet, bolt, bullet. Somebody married, cover up, not a. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. See, I lost subscribers the last time I posted y'all reading, but here we go. I got twin flames finally back together, reunited, and the dick gotta be good, cause somebody's sneaking around. Why they married too? Look at it, and they know that they shouldn't. Layers, multiple factors, not a hundred percent fake as fuck. That marriage or that relationship is rocky, shabby, it ain't going nowhere. But they've been night and whining with you, which is why there's some hidden secrets here trying to prevent the truth from coming out. This is living a lie, living in secrecy, the same energy. So, I'm you know what. I'm not sure who gets upset with me when I say something that's real. If this part is not, if this is not your reading this week, see you next time, right? This ain't gonna resonate. And I hate saying it because it sounds like I'm not authentic. I'm just reading the cards that are coming out here today. Spirit says, stop. I stopped and justice was at the bottom of the deck. Come on now. But anyways, there's someone here in the Libra energy that needs to hear me. Do not be sneaking around with somebody that's married. Or if you're married, stop sneaking around. Can't tell you what to do, but I said what I said because that's what's here. Stop sneaking around, living a lie, not being a hunted, being fake, being secretive, force of nature. And it may even be 
some kind of nympho energy but you know what oh this your twin they sneaking around with you which means you also need to cut ties with them because you're enabling them to never grow if you allow them to come towards you and cheat on you know, their person with you or you're doing the cheating no one's growing no one's evolving the moon for libra But what about when they not, when they are around? Wait a minute, let me get another. Three of Pentacles. I'm like, why well, jump over there? Hmm. Collaboration, third party. Glowing. Lights up whenever near you or someone mentions you. Presence, no one exists when you are around. I feel like someone has repressed emotions for you with the moon that they're not sharing or they're not telling or it's deeper than what it is like it could be sexually based but it's more than it mm -hmm. they want to take things slow y'all been getting real sticky in the bedroom yep with the molasses syrup in that ways spirit what is hidden with the moon falling over not a hundred percent them coming your way spontaneously randomly or this you what's hidden is all of this spontaneous energy i'm telling you somebody holding leverage over their head or you got leverage over them it's giving what's a good example for leverage in a relationship if you leave then i can take this or i can do this it's, that's kind of like blackmail but it's a thin line between leverage and blackmail they do something for you now they feel like you owe them one or vice versa spontaneous though headed towards you i feel like the leverage could be whoever they with mm -hmm. maybe that person may make a move on them financially take the kids take the call take the house something so the secret is them headed towards you secretively hmm interesting and how does Libra show up in that? Or oh, this you. How does Libra show up in that secret, spontaneous energy? Libra shows up like relocated, quit job, or got fired, purse clean, see you, but doesn't want to open up. Relocated. That's some distracted energy. Moving around, change. Distracted. Gets distracted from work. Puts things off that you're working on. Procrastinate. Clean to you. Does, they get your hopes up to where you're clinging to them. Mm-hmm. Doesn't want to open up. You you start wanting more from this person. Paranoid. Worried about getting caught in your head. You ask them, when are they moving? Relocated. When are you moving? When are you done with that? When is this going to change? They put you in your head, paranoid purse. Yeah, every time this person comes your way with relocated paranoid purse, you start wondering when is things going to change or this is how they feel with you, period. And it's all dealing with the moon. I'm still on that. There's some kind of secret connection where someone actually has deep emotions for you. I mean deep emotions, but it's something going on that's not favorable that lacks integrity. Or this is somebody connected to you. Maybe a friend, a cousin, or something. It keep coming out. Can't hide that. What's Tower for Libra? It's a lot going on right there. Okay, some of y'all could have met somebody that was cheated on a lot, so they may be guarded. That's also something with that clings to you but doesn't want to open up. They like you, but they've been hurt before. So they're not 100%. They're hiding. Or they haven't revealed what they have already experienced in life. Tower for Libra. Somebody's also hiding the fact that they're broke. Tower random that's a towel that's tower energy random and towel spot uh uh what is it situation or person popped up abruptly out of nowhere damn what's the, what is the towel though like what happened or what will happen since i'm learning that i see things a month or two ahead of time with me predicting death in my family the towel and conspicuous wanting you to stay but being low-key about it unsure communication not clear with inconspicuous you don't know where you stand with this person all of us what's the justice i'm gonna come back to that what's the justice
different goals don't want the same things finally seeing it for what it is using that integrity if you're the person dealing with this you're gonna have to tap into that sense of knowing sense of balance sense of just sense of rightfulness righteousness and integrity as this card says because you and this person are not on the same page you may want something serious they may want to flink around in or cheat or vice versa doing what's right and taking accountability for your actions now let's go back to random what's the random part of this open door leaving room for you to return some of y'all could be dealing with a twin my twin just texts me so open door leaving room for you to return i feel like this is a situation where it's given with this dog in a walkway you can come in if you want to you can come over if you want to you can accept me as i am if you want to the door is open it's up to you mm -mm. pick it back up could be in and out of your life what's the tower bragging telling people getting caught what's this man say thoughts prayers deepest condolences hmm a maze i feel like there's a physical attraction what's the release part of this tower release what cheaters Where the car go? <laughs> Where it go? My bad spirit. Oh my god! Oh my god! Release what? Release what? I don't give a fuck what Libra on the planet is mad at me for speaking the truth. You gotta hear me. Release this third party situation. I don't care who mad. Because I, I got a lot of people that unsubscribe. If you're in a third party situation, I am the messenger to encourage you, to give you tough love, to tell you this is not of integrity. You're being guided to stop cheating or stop letting somebody cheat with you. Period. Closing card for Libra. Because I ain't being hurt and I'm being treated as the, the suspect. Okay. <laughs> Closing card for Libra. Let me get out of my ego. That's what the cards say. For Libra. Closing cards here. What else? I mean, I need to focus on home and see what else life has to offer you with Inspector and moving in and online drama and being stuck in your head overthinking negative outlook and relax get a peace of mind find a peace of mind if you're sneaking around and you're a third party situation you're gonna always be on edge when we gonna get called or what's gonna happen like stop living a lie or this is your person cheating on you and you need to release them because they're a cheater however it go let me let me throw that scenario in there if you're doing the cheating or you're the person that they're cheating with, release it. Now, if you are in a situation where you're the victim to the cheating, release it because they're a cheater. Fuck forgiveness on this. You can forgive them and move on, but we ain't got to forgive and restart because they obviously are a serial cheater. Okay, don't be posting online. Don't be overblogging, speaking your truth, and don't be putting your business out on front street, and don't be trying to take pictures and send little hints in your stories. That is not of integrity. Put, posting a dude with an emoji on his face that is not of integrity how they go this is y'all read take a break focus on you pull back from all of this third party mess wherever you fit in it this is the energy that i have for libra at this time that's just that's just what it is peace and love